Well, I wish you'd look at this. As pretty as it was yesterday with no wind, now storm blew in. We got wind, but it's coming straight on shore. And look how it's wavy as hell. I mean, it's really not even, even if somebody really knew how to ride when it's straight on shore, you know, you're just really going across, across the grain instead of out and back. It's just not even enough wind for that. It's right at the edge of being close to being good for that, but I don't know. Maybe a good kiter will show up. You never know. It'd be interesting to see somebody kite this. Last year, about this same time, there was two girls that went out in weather like this. I may find the video and I'll put a link in the description to show you what it looked like back then. It was a year ago. I'm going to get across that wall and, and uh, show you what the rest of the beach looks like. Well, as you can see, the wind is blowing right into my face. Not good for kiteboarding. Yeah, it washed out all this beach. But it'll build it back in the next few days. Look at the clouds back back that way. I wanted to show you um, when they talk about mangrove, mangrove swamps, this is that type of area. See back over there and it just, that's what, yeah, it's, it's like a mangrove swamp. And when it rains, it has to, because the elevation wise, it has to go back to the sea. And this is a natural trench right here that it, that's the purpose of the trench. It's, and I just want to show you, look at the volume. It's for hours it's been coming down, draining from this rain that came last night at about six o'clock. I don't know how many inches it rained, but it rained quite a bit. As you can see, we still got wave action. And you see how the mangrove has that brown color. So the monster braid would be very dark. Danny trying to get across. 